Over four decades with WCPO, Papo has been part of a lot of memorable stories and a lot of memorable moments. Nine on your sides, Jake Ryle went into the vault to find some of Papo's highlights. For 40 years. And they offered me a ride of a lifetime. And what a ride it was. Here he is riding down a bobsled course, his career full of twists and turns. No GoPro needed. Papo wanted to bring the action to you. Sometimes it's surprising he didn't break a hip. Anyway, my journey on the unicycle turned into a wipeout. He's been there for some of Cincinnati's greatest moments. When everyone focused on the field during Pete Rose hit number 4192, well, Papo turned the camera and captured something memorable. The moment was overwhelming. Pete's brother David put his arms around his mother. They embraced and cried for the next several minutes. For four decades, Papo brought out the best in everyone. It still has some of the old. Oh, it's, it, it, it's still that same aura when you come in here. The miracle of Milan. He was fake left and went right and went up and it went in. Honest, he did that on his first and only try. From the young athletes to the youngest at heart, he covered every story with compassion. A memorable one, Boomer Esiason's son, Gunner, diagnosed with cystic fibrosis. Papo spent a day in New York to bring his story to light. I expect to see a nice little choo-choo train. Here it comes. What I get is Amtrak, Lionel Heaven. And it's easy to see this is a favorite spot for Gunner and his dad to come. They set it up together, they run the railroad together. Whoa, and when they had a wreck, they put it all back together, together. The better question for Papo, what didn't he do? We saw him throw out the first pitch at a Reds game. It had more movement than a Luis Castillo curveball. He reported live from the sideline, even the stars wanted to be around him. Here's former Cincinnati Bengal Chad Johnson photobombing a live report. He held down the anchor desk with grace. When it came to Sunday nights, there was one thing you could always count on. Nine Sports presents. Sports of all sorts. We always got Papo's best. Nobody did it better. From the fishing edition to countless guests, you could always count on memorable moments. Jim and <laughs> Make me laugh. All right. Jim and Trent, Papa, what's happening? More than just this, Jim and Trent is up. How is things in Trent, Jim? For 33 years, he connected the Tri-State to their favorite athletes. He gave them a voice. Thanks for staying up with us. For the Channel 9 sports staff, I'm John Popovich. Hope your week is a winner. So what words do you say to a guy who has meant so much to so many? Well, I can think of two. Thank you. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's incredible. For the ride of a lifetime. Oh my, what a, a career yeah. and how lucky we all are to have worked with you. And I'm Papa. so proud of the young man who just told that story because Jake oh, Ryle was one of our amazing. interns. He yeah. was a sports intern yeah. and uh, just to see how he oh. turned out is wonderful. And he admires you so much as we all do. Well, you're very kind. Thank you very much.